Hello and welcome to the first episode of Tips, Tricks, and Takeaways. I'm your host, John Butterworth, and today we are looking at the snare weight brass number five. Welcome back to the first episode of Tips, Tricks, and Takeaways. Uh, I started making this show because I grew up playing drums. I have worked at drum shops. I have worked at drum companies. I've taught drums uh, all the way from beginner all the way up to the collegiate level. And I've toured extensively in Los Angeles, Boston, and now Nashville. The point of this show is to share with you some of the tricks that I've come across uh, in my travels and spotlight some companies that I've come to absolutely love and, and the products that they make. Today we are looking at the flagship line over at the company snare weight. This is the brass number five. If nothing else, uh, this thing is just a piece of art. It's hand uh, machined from solid brass, so it's heavy. This thing is the real deal and everything that I've ever wanted out of a dampening system. Um, like I mentioned, it is machined from uh, solid brass and they use a lot of magnets. The way it actually attaches to your snare drum is there's a magnet in the back that attaches to any snare drum rim. Uh, and then to dampen the drum, it uses a series of inserts. So the, uh, the insert that comes with the snare weight is a, a leather insert that attaches magnetically. But you can also get aftermarket inserts. These are the 70s inserts. And then for all of you uh, die cast hoop users, the uh, magnet's not actually going to work on this hoop, but all you have to do is buy an additional um, Pro Lock. It, this is also machined out of solid brass, and it just fits really nice and easily via magnet. Um, over the snare weight and it will uh, keep your snare weight locked onto your snare drum. And kind of to add a cherry on the top, uh, the case that the snare weight comes in is spring loaded, which is really neat. And this is padded on the inside with foam. And so it makes it for easy transport and easy protection. Again, they have thought of everything over its snare weight and I'm uh, really excited to show you how this sounds on the drum. Okay, so looking at the brass snare weight number five, I am using a DW six and a half by 14 black nickel over brass snare drum tuned relatively low. Uh, so this is what the snare drum sounds like without the snare weight on it. And then if we put on the snare weight, which again, I'm using the uh, leather insert that comes with the snare weight. The way it attaches to the drum is super simple. Uh, there's a magnet on here, and if you just get it close, it uh, clips right on. And the cool thing, uh, really quick, is there's even a piece of felt that goes against the, um, the magnet so that there's no clicking or uh, external noise when you play, which is so cool. So it just snaps right on. Another cool part about this product, with the way that it attaches to the drum, um, as you hit it, there's a little bit of rocking motion that is allowed. So it allows the drum to breathe a little bit and allows the, the sound to be a little uh, more natural sounding. So here's uh, the snare drum with the snare weight on it. So again, not too much dampening, uh, enough to take away unwanted overtones. And again, I think it just sounds absolutely fantastic. Now say that's not enough dampening for you. You can easily remove the insert. And my personal favorite addition uh, to the snare weight are the 70s inserts. Now these are just two pieces of leather and with magnets, they attach. 
So this gives it a lot more of a dampening uh, effect. Say that's too much dampening. Here's a cool part. You can just use one of them. So again, real quick, going through all of the various options. So you can do this in between songs, you can do this in between sets for different snare drums. It's super simple. So this is without the snare weight. With the snare weight, with the leather insert. With one of the 70s inserts. and with both. And for all of you die-cast hoop users, uh, this uh, magnet won't actually work on the die-cast hoops. All you have to do is buy the snare weight pro lock, which by using magnets, uh, you can just slip it over the outside of the rim real easily, and it uh, holds the snare weight securely on the snare drum. I even like to use it on all of my triple flanged hoops as well, uh, just to, as a sort of peace of mind. Again, this is just such an amazing product from Matt and the, uh, the team over at Snare Weight. They are handmade. The brass number no. five is hand machined in San Francisco, California. It's just an amazing product, super durable, will last you forever and it just looks amazing on your drum. One of the things I love about this system is the snare weight and the leather inserts will lift off the drum as you play them, giving it a little more dynamic range and uh, allowing the drum to breathe a little bit, which is something you don't get with a, a, like a moon gel sticky substance or if you put gaff tape on your drum. Um, I, I find that that <clears throat> tends to change the tuning a little bit and uh, kind of make the drum feel stifled. Uh, the snare weight does not do that. The price on these brass number no. fives, they are not cheap, but they are well worth it. Uh, you can buy this snare weight for $109, and then the 70s inserts are a little extra, and the Pro Lock, if you need it, are a little extra. Uh, you can buy them on the snare weight website at uh, snareweight.com, or uh, if you live in Nashville, uh, you can get them at the Drum Supply House, which is a fantastic little drum shop, or at Nelson's Drum Shop. Both owners are fantastic. I highly recommend you check them out. The Snare Weight, fantastic product. This is the Brass Number no. 5. Thank you all for tuning in to the first episode of Tips, Tricks, and Takeaways. If you have any questions or if you want to leave a comment, feel free to drop something in the, uh, in the message box below. If you like what you saw, feel free to like the video, give me a follow, and make sure you tune in for my next episode. Thanks so much and have a fantastic day.